Hello and welcome back to the Flat Chat. I'm the host for the world's hardest football quiz. Hey again. With Jacob and Callum. You might notice there is a man missing. He will be missing for a good few weeks now. He's on a well-deserved break. Mm. Alan will be watching, he'll be commenting, we know it. He'll get full marks, probably. Yeah, but <laughs> you are, you're going to fail today because you don't have them. Yep. The way He's... this works, there's four rounds. All the boys need to do is pass the test. Let's go on to the rules. Okay. Four rounds for the boys to complete. They must reach a certain score in order to pass. They will only find out the score at the end of the video. Once they have liked and subscribed, what is the like goal, Jacob? Um, We're going to go for 3-2-2. Two, two. Okay. Let's do it, everyone. And... At the time of recording, but at 8,900 subscribers. Mm. We are on the march to 10k. It's exciting. Yeah. There will be a 10k special as well. And so let, let us know if you're the 322nd yeah. like. Also, let us know what we should do for that 10,000 yeah. subscriber special. Special. Sure. Yeah. Sure. 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 Let's, <laughs> <laughs> Let's get straight into it, boys. <laughs> round number one, connections. In this round, you will be given four clues to help you answer the question. If you get the answer after the first clue, then you get four points, the second three, the third two, and the final clue, one. However, if you fail, you lose a point. Can I get a bold and pen? Arn usually throws me over, but he's not here. Added man. What's he doing? What's he doing? What a catch. Oh, there we go. He's a catch. Right, player number one, Paul Lambert. Okay. Played for Liverpool, took penalties, didn't miss. Wait, no, wrong one. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> That's Ricky Lambert. <laughs> Aaron's not here. I'll do it. I'll fill in that job. Aaron's infected that couch. Oh, no. Unbelievable um, start. That's brilliant. Well, Lambert, played for Dortmund, he's Scottish. And he managed Aston Villa. <laughs> Maybe Ricky Lambert's next. It could be Lambert's. <laughs> <laughs> he captain Celtic, I'm sure. Yeah, right. So it could be that. It could be Champions League one in nineties. I think it was he a captain of Dortmund. I don't think nah, so. I would imagine so. I wouldn't have thought so. I wouldn't have thought so. We all we know is from Dortmund and Celtic. What about like in Scotland? Something to do with Scottish players playing in Germany. Could just be Scottish manager. It could be anything really, couldn't it? So like McLeish. Villa managers? Villa managers. I say we just go Villa managers. Yeah, yeah. Go Villa yeah. managers. Villa managers. Yeah. yeah. That is not the connection. Player number two, Ryan Kent. Ooh. Okay. He's played in Germany. Played in Scotland, played in Germany. He yeah. played for Cologne. Played in Scotland, played in Germany. Yeah. Easy. Yeah. Go for it. Yeah, played in Scotland, played in Germany. That is not the connection. Oh, but it, it, it's, it's, it's going to be that. Is, but player number three, Emil Smith Rowe. That isn't. Played, oh, in played in England, yeah. played in Germany. Played in the UK, played in Germany. Oh, one of the two, isn't Paul it? Lambert played in England, though. Managed? I just thought that's all I know. Played for South. Aaron, where are you, pal? This is where we need that. Maybe he did. Took penalties for Southampton. I can't believe I said that. <laughs> Actually, uh, I can. I he can. played in Germany, played in England. Did Paul Lambert? Did he know. though? Brits in Germany. Like Leeds or something? British no. players in Germany. Played in the UK. Played in Germany. How niche do we need to be yeah. here, Mister Quizmaster? You need to be niche than played in the UK and played in Germany, right? But England does niche. That could be what he wrote. You know, England does niche. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what else could they have done? It's going to be to do with it's Germany. It's going, to be with, it's going to be with the Bundesliga. It's million percent. Maybe he wants us to be niche and say he played in the UK and in the Bundesliga. I just said, and you need to be niche than that. You need to be niche Germany. No. <laughs> Give it any of the German leagues. No, no, no. It's going to be played in the. Played in England? <laughs> yeah, just say it. England. What else we got? England, Germany. Or attackers that played there. Is he, like, how niche Midfielders he that played. Midfielders that played in. That's going England to England and I don't the like that. Liga. Nah, we're not take take the midfielder part out. I think maybe. Yeah. Unless you want. It doesn't matter. So, so what is your answer? <laughs> what, what, what do you want from? What us? do you want from? Yeah, we know the answer. I want an answer. I mean, we've got it. We know what it is. We know what they all did. So tell me the one I've got wrote down. Played in, in England and in the German league. Yeah. That is not the connection. Oh, exactly. Player number four, Jaden Sancho. Yeah, it's still midfielder. <laughs> it's the exact same. Yeah, it's the same thing. They all did. Like they might have all did, but 
Well, they're a bit niche. They're not all wingers. You can't if you're saying Kent's a midfield, they always play in the wing. That's got nothing to do with possession. Right. Okay. I know I'm annoyed. This could be a negative one start. How about we kick your head on? No. They've all played in Germany. Yeah, they have. You've established that. All... Is that part of the answer? Very well very well could be. They've all played in the UK. How many players have played in the UK and Germany? That is not niche at all. Yeah, but they're British. We've already Don't, said that. We he said, you said, oh, you've got to go niche. Ah, I yeah. didn't say that. He definitely <coughs> said ah, you niche. did. I, you said UK and Germany. And I said, you need to be niche than that. UK That's and all Germany. That's not what you said. I don't know what you're saying here. Ah, so if it's if okay, British and played in Germany. Is that what you're trying to find? Yeah. Let's see if you're right. Yeah, it's bit British players to play in the Bundesliga. I think we should. Uh, do you know what? I do you know the end? He's, he's, he's going to have our score, but we're going to have. We'll have our score. Do you want to take well, note of our score? We are three. We will. We will replay it for the people at home because we can do that. You yeah. said. UK and Germany, and I said you need to be initial in that. That's all you said. You need to be initial and played in the UK and played in Germany. Right. Round one and he's won me up. <laughs> he's played won, in the UK and in Germany. He's won me up on round That's one. what you said. That, that wasn't the answer. It's, they're from the UK. Unlucky. Next up, we've got Vince, Vicente Del Bosque. He was the Spain manager right. when they won the World <laughs> Cup in the Euros. Well, that, like, yeah, it's, this is not, it's not to do with... 2010, sequencing. 14, 18, 22. Last four World Cup winning managers. Yeah. Last four World Cup winning managers. No. Oh, Next. Raging. Answer. Fabio Capello. Hmm. Who's also Real Madrid the manager. managers. Brilliant. They manage Real Madrid. Brilliant. Real Madrid managers. Brilliant. That's right. Well done. Come on. We would have had Manuel Pellegrini. Terrible. Terrible. I try again, try again. There. Manuel Pellegrini and Zinedine Zidane. They're Real Madrid managers. I'll take Three it. points. We needed that. We up needed to, something. Up to six. I'm not going to write it Up to four. Up to and six. Four. <laughs> and the next one. Les Ferdinand. Ooh. Headed goals. You think he's in the top four? Yeah, I think he would be. Okay. He's the kind of... That's, what, that's just what I think of when I see him. Cool. We'll do that. Headed goals. Headed goals. Well, no, like no. Most oh, wait, headed hold goals on. We do need to be more niche yeah. here. Most headed goals in Premier League. He's fourth. <laughs> or whatever. Yeah. Crouch is top. Cahill's second. Most headed goals. Yeah. That is... Correct. <laughs> Gal, that's un- it's all you think of, last man. We'd have had Dion Dublin, Alan Shearer, and Peter Crouch. Oh, okay, oh you know what? Unbelievable. You know what? You can take those. You can rob those yeah, points in the first round. We don't, we don't want them anymore. There, there is zero robbing in the first round. <laughs> oh. On to round number two. We have sequences. In this round, three images will Get be on. shown to you in some sort of sequence okay. to gain one point. You just need to tell me the next answer in the sequence. You can also gain a point by saying the sequence correctly. Say both, you get two. Here's the first one. Okay. That's my favourite. We've favorite. got Alexander Isaac, Tenali, Gordon. I think that's Newcastle's highest signs. Yeah. There could be a Botman or a Joe Linton. Or a Bruno, Bruno G. I think he was slightly less. He was like 35 to 40. Yeah, because Arsenal don't Who did I say it. first? Joe Linton and somebody else. Joe Linton was Bottom. 40. You said Bottom, bro. Joe Linton was 40 Bottom. million. Was he? I think so. It's ridiculous. I think he was 40 million pounds. Bruno G was around about that as well. I don't think he was more than 40, though. I think he was... Oh, why did something. Arsenal not pay it? Because... Oh, He'd have been good for should have paid it. Should've I definitely think it's that. Newcastle's highest... Because Isaac's... Yeah. yeah oh, no, I, think Newcastle, it, I, I think you are right about what Did Newcastle it make a big sign in the end this time? No. No, they were just like It's going to be gay... gay. That was it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're um, definitely confirmed with that. But is it one of those three? Botman, I don't know how much he could have been. 45? Is it presented on BBC? Oh no, it's just Claire Balding. <laughs> <laughs> right. Retention rate is down after that one. <laughs> I say we go for... I like Joe Linton the most. Who do you like the most? I don't like any of them. He's a horrible, horrible man. I like him as a player though. You want him no, wait, Bruno G's the horrible man, actually. I'm going Joe Linton. I won't go against you. I don't really know. We'll say Joe Linton, Newcastle's highest, highest. transfer yeah. fees. Quite to find out the answer. It was Harvey Barnes. Oh, we never even nah, thought of nah, it. No, it didn't come there. Nah. But we got, ah, you we got one point. We'll take it. He take was it. that much. 
he was. How much was he? I don't know the exact yeah, figure. He but... must have been above 40, though. 45, maybe. Yeah. All right. Hopefully Sequence. Scotland's next winger. <laughs> Sequence <laughs> number two. You've got Real Madrid, Dortmund, Inter. PSG, Hakimi. Yeah. Too easy. Last four clubs of Akraf Hakimi. Is that too easy, though? Or it could be... Well, there was... Are they... There was loans involved there, wasn't there? Nah, but I think it will be just that. Yeah, not like Champions League runner-ups or anything like that. Did Madrid lose a Champions League final? No. (laughs) Don't be silly. silly. (laughs) Is it not that record? They've never lost one. Probably, man. Never, not in our lifetime, anyway. I I think it is just that. Yeah, we'll just say Hakimi. I looked at his career path today, so... Hakimi, Paris Saint-Germain. So your answer is Hakimi, (laughs) PSG. Are we saying that? Hakimi's last four clubs. Yeah. Let's see if you're right. I think it's too easy. You're right. Oh, well done. Yeah. Come on, boys. You, need, you yeah. need to give me an actual answer instead. Ah, I did yeah, say yeah, 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 yeah. He did say Hashcraft. We're just in a half from the first round. It's so. the two stooges over there. <laughs> no, we're number, good. We're fine. Number three. <laughs> we've got Cannavaro, Ronaldo, Modric. Okay. What have they all done? That's Cannavaro. That's Cannavaro. Where's his big bald head? This is when he had hair. Back but he doesn't day. look... This looks recent. That Fabio Cannavaro. <laughs> the one, the very one. Does he not have a brother? He does. He's even, yeah, no, he does. Why does he look like that? Because that's what he looks like, bro. Is that him now? Yeah. He looks weird, man. Don't Is like there a it. reason he got a picture of him now? He won the Ballon d'Or. Ronaldo's won the Ballon d'Or. Modric won the Ballon d'Or. Yeah, but so is Real Madrid's Ballon d'Or winners. He... Benzema. Was Cannavaro at Madrid or does that not even matter? I don't know. He won I mean, it for... he was at Madrid, but was he at Madrid yeah. when he won it? But does that even matter? Of the last four that have played for Real Madrid, I mean, I think he'll give us it anyway. You know, he's a nice guy, that guy over there. You know, he doesn't rob us of points. You so. need to have what it's wrote down. I think Benzema's a great shout, though. Yeah. Karim Benzema. Karim Benzema and last four Real Madrid Ballon d'Or winners. Is that fitting in the box? <laughs> Aye. Last four Real Madrid Ballon d'Or winners. That'll yeah. fit in. <laughs> we're just, final we're answer? trying to see if it fits in the box <laughs> anything can fit in the box if you really want it to quite deep we'll go that yeah see with this one oh. I thought about this before, while I was making the quiz mm-hmm. that could technically be an acceptable answer but Kaka was after Cannavaro so, or is it four alright I don't know so what I had wrote down was the last four European Ballon d'Or winners but Kaka did play for Milan when he won it. So I will give you the point. Was Cannavaro at Madrid when he won it? Yes. Ah, so right. you were right. You gave us the point for that? I'm giving you it. Right. You know what? You know that whole oh, first wow. round? I actually... You, I you take actually, it back. I take it back. You know what? I do. Was, I, it, Logan, I, I was actually, it Logan Paul says at the start? Well, I'd like to... Apolo- his apology. What's I, don't his what I don't know what you're talking about. I can't remember. We have no idea, but we apologise to Hege and yeah, to all yeah. of yours for our bad behaviour. Thanks, Hege. Sequence number four. We've got A E K Ghent A Z Alkmaar. I believe it's A E K Larnica. Right, I believe. Right, right, I'm glad you gave us that at least. This is a good gen app. The people at home will get it and they'll love it. Who 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 are they? The first team. Where are they from? Probably helped us. Larnica. Do you want me to tell you where they're from? Please. I mean, I, I... they're from Cyprus. Okay. <laughs> they all give off <laughs> conference league. Vibes. It's the vibes. That's all you need. That's true. You need the vibes. That's true. A E K, Larnaca, and Ghent and A Z. Are they just called K A A Gent? Gent. <laughs> Gent. Gent. <laughs> Gent. Yeah. God. Just I was thinking about like alphabetical order. It's or something embarrassing like that. saying something like that in a video. Yeah. Oh. You st- your opening was uh... <laughs> What would be the alphabetical order? It's K at the start, bro. Where's the K? Uh, that's what I'm saying. In case they were something known as something. Like double AK. <sighs> this guy. I'm trying. Is this like a career path of somebody? Who? <laughs> Cyprus to that Belgium to Netherlands to England. Well done if you get this at home. I've never I've never heard of that first team. I've heard of Larnaca. Obviously. I've, I've not seen the, ba- the badge. I've not seen the badge. Yeah, I didn't yeah. recognise the badge, but that doesn't say much. I don't think we're getting anything here. Nah, we're not. Not looking good at the moment. So what was hard to squeeze after all? Yeah. Altmar in the end, did they get to the Conference League final? 
but that's not it. <sighs> I think they got to the final. Didn't Wait, they? maybe it'd be like a set of teams that somebody beat to get to the final. To win the conference league. Yeah. To West Ham. No, it wasn't that year. It was more recent. Um, oh. Yeah, because Dundee United played at Alkmaar, so it was just... Was it the West Ham? So you think it could be Fiorentina? It could be Fiorentina, but like, why does Heggie care about Fiorentina? I like it. Go Fiorentina, West Ham's... Oh wait, I was meaning as I'm in Fiorentina. No, okay. Yeah, I like that. We're going to do that. Do so, what? Wait. No? What are we saying? West Ham... <laughs> No, no, sorry. No, no, Fiorentina, Fiorentina, West Ham. They beat Fiorentina. West Ham beat Fiorentina yeah. in the final. The teams, four teams, West Ham beat. What about what league. about if it's Olympiacos and it's still Fiorentina? But Fiorentina's what we're going for, right? Yeah, we're saying it's Fiorentina. And then just say West Ham because I feel they played at AZ Alkmaar. They feel it. I just feel like they did. That was an adding line if I've ever held one. They never well, now I'm gonna be it. wrong. So. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, let's go Olympiacos then. No, uh, we'll say Fiorentina for yeah. that last square. Okay. Yeah. And then we'll say the teams that West Ham beat in their way to win the Conference League. You'll, you'll, give, it, you'll give us it if it's... If it's yeah, <laughs> this guy, man. He's, he has absolutely he's tried it a lot more than me. Let's see if he's all right. He's I all mean, right. I said that word you for did. word. You Come did. on. It is. It's West Ham's route to winning the Conference League. Who would have thought Lanarka would have got out of the groups? Not me. Fair play. No idea. Everyone's favourite round's up next. Let's no, no, let's brace no. ourselves for the crying of this. Ooh. But before that, Callum hits with a half time team hear talk. It. Go on. What am I saying? <laughs> oh, sorry. Time. T- <laughs> <laughs> this <laughs> guy, man. Just let's hear it. What am I doing? I'll do it. Yeah, I'll you do, do it. it. So I, I, I'm, no, I'm I want your Callum do it. He's <laughs> never done it. No, I'm not doing it. <laughs> if you want to get some of our flat chat merch, check the link in the bio. You can get t shirts like myself, hoodies like Heggies. Be sure to check it out after you've watched us complete the world's hardest quiz. On to round number three, we have the connection wall. In this round, 12 answers will be shown. You must put them into four separate categories. Three answers in each category. You will get a point for every correct category if the players in the category match the final answer on the next slide. If you get all four correct, you will gain an extra point. It says that there, right? Mm -hmm. But today, you don't get the extra point. Unless you tell me the exact reason they're all connected. I, I respect that. So that's where the extra point is today. Okay? That's okay. fair. Okay. Yeah. So if you get them all right, you that's get four. four points. Yeah. But if you get why they're all right, yeah, that's, that's an extra point. Okay, that's big. That could be the difference. Yeah. On to the first one. We've got Emmanuel Petit, Luca Modric, Rio Ferdinand, Danny Olmo, Troy Deeney, Ashley Young, Christopher Nkunku, Gary Lineker, Tammy Abraham, Gabriel Magalhaes, Nicholas Anelka. Chris Smalling. Lanarkar and Anelka both played in China, I think. Did anyone else? No. No, it was Japan Lineker played on. Ah, apologies. That's that out of the windy. <laughs> <laughs> right. What about things for like something to do with Christmas? There's Emmanuel, there's Chris Christ, Gabriel. there's Nicholas, there's Gabriel. there's Gabriel. Gabriel, there's Abraham. There's a lot of people from the Bible there. There is. I think he loves a Bible question. He does. Yeah, that was you, wasn't it, actually? Yeah, that was Jacob. It's a good question, though. There's lots there. Not Ash. a good start. Hmm. I'm just looking for, like, set that. Uh, You've got one clue. Don't look at the names. No, I'm not. Get that out your noggin. Okay, it's gone. Right. Almo. And Kunku both played for Leipzig. I don't know if any of the others did. Could young Abraham Smalling just be English players in Italy? Yeah, it could be. Should I could put that be. down for just now? Yeah, we'll have it. We'll, we'll whack it down. At least you've got something in the bold. Yeah. Might not be right, but it's, it's down there. <laughs> Petit and Kunku and Elka, French Chelsea. Did Petit play for Chelsea? Yeah, he did. Just let me know when you want to turn up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still looking at the names for some reason, even though they told me not to. Uh, Dini. What has Dini done? Played. He's a pundit now, is he not? So is Lineker, so is Ferdinand. Yeah. You, sh- you showed up. Yep. Thank you very much. I don't, know, I don't even know who we've got left. Modric is definitely one of them. You do have left Modric, Olmo, and Gabriel. Hmm. I don't think they match up. Do that you spelled Magalish. Uh huh. Wow. No chance we'd ever got that. Modric, Olmo. Oh my. Where did you get Gabriel from? Leo. 
Where did he play before that? At the age of like 60? I don't know. I don't know that. Right. Remember, if you get them all right, but not why, you still yeah. get four points. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <sighs> it's nothing to do with our names. Look at Modric. Give you 30 seconds. Has Gabriel done anything for Brazil? Played a few times. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Oh, these are so tough. I say we just put that as the last one. Oh, we're writing it down for now, but there's got to be something. We've got to get something in our heads. Almo, Magalhães, and Modric. So there's Leipzig. There's. Well, did Almo play for a Spanish team before Leipzig? No. That's wrong. Five seconds. This has been. We get nothing really. Right, talk me through it. One of you's talk, the other can think about the last one if he's wanted. Okay, I'll talk. Okay. <laughs> get thinking. Wait, so First one we've got is young Abraham and smalling English players that have played in Italy. It's bang on. Nice. Then we've got Petit and Elka and Kunku, French Chelsea players. That's also bang on. Then we have Lineker, Dini, Ferdinand, and they are all uh, pundits. Or So I had, they were all players with a podcast but it's the same yeah, same yeah. thing right, okay. thank you for that thanks and then finally we have Gabriel Magalish uh-huh. look at his middle name there actually I'm not actually sure what his middle name is I bet he's got a really he long definitely name. has a really yeah. uh, Daniel Mascaredo Olmo <laughs> and Luka Modric have all have all what have they done Jacob they've all they've all got you four points well done they have what they've all done, they've all played for Dinamo Zagreb. Would never have got that. I was always asking where he played beforehand. As Leipzig signed Olmo from Zagreb. Wow. Modric obviously played a lot. Yeah. Gabriel was on loan from Lille to Dinamo Zagreb. <laughs> Did not know that. That's wow. crazy. Wow. Fair. So world's hardest quiz? Yeah, uh, no, fair we'll play. We'll take a four. Fair we'll play. take our yeah. four. On to the next connection wall. We've got Marcus Rashford, Ollie Watkins, Mohamed Salah, Cole Palmer, Bakayo Saka, Elliot Anderson, Scott Wright, Matteo Kovacic, Emmanuel Adebayor, Greg Taylor, Jaden Sancho, Robinho. This was an Aaron inspired bold, I must say. Is he going to still call Anderson Scottish? Could Wright Taylor Anderson just be three Scottish players? I mean, he's not Scottish though, is he? He's he was called up to a Scotland squad. Right, but he can't, he's not actually Scottish. In this bold, he's not Scottish. Brilliant. Thanks. We need, at least we got that out of the way. Well, eh, it could be Scottish. There's the... So he's English, British, maybe? No. Dual like... nationality. No, <gasps> no, nothing to do with that. Oh, I'm excited there. I don't know if, I then. If, you, if you know, you know. It was very expensive. Hmm. Right, Palmer and Rashford. Oh. Palmer, Saka, and Watkins all scored at the Euros knockout stages for England. England's knockout stage scorers. Yeah, they did. But what's Salah got to do with all of this? Because I feel like he's a right winger, right? With Saka. Is there any other right wingers? Palmer's a right winger. Sancho. Oh, I don't see anything right now. It's never good. Sancho. English, oh, English Sancho, winger. Sancho's a winger. Sancho, Robinho, Palmer all played for Man City. Kovacic as well, the wee rascal. <laughs> I think the England thing is fine. I think Kovacic, Sancho, would have been your man. Oh, Adebayor! What are you doing to me, man? <sighs> I apologise for my like, burst there. Sorry, Jacob. But I am wound up. Minute and a half left. Nah, come on now. I've I there's no Aaron, though, but there's no Aaron. So there's definitely got to take time why I, That's why I added 30 seconds. <laughs> Alright, let's. I'm looking at the letters, uh, the the names for finding. It's not going to be names. He's bored of names. You just never know. Is there names involved in this? Should we be looking at names? There's something related to names, but you won't find it looking at the names per se. <laughs> okay. Okay. Related. To some players have the same name as something else. There's your clue. Why is it an Arden inspired bold? Maybe he's done the exact same category before. It's to do with something like an Arden answer. Something no, Arden no. said that's just stupid. No. 
Oh, this is horror. This is a tricky one. We have done at home if you got it. I don't think we have. We've no done offense. nothing. We've not even wrote a word. So There's so to, many bad city We're going to have to just guess, like, names. Mix them together here. I think why could players be related? Players were like the same son name. I'm going to need an answer what, right about now. You're going to just need to start throwing people yeah. together. Let's just write things down. What did you say? What do you feel could be together? Absolutely all of them. I think they could be. It'll start with the ones that you don't think could be together and then, do you know what I mean? What now from that? Anderson, Adam Wright and Taylor. And probably played together. Madrid and City. Anyone else? No. Yeah, Kovacic. Cool. Let's get it down. Well done. Anything else there? No, I've cooked enough. Yeah, I was cooking you. just put Anderson. S- anyone else, Man United? No. Nah. Right, what have you got? So far, keep going. Um, we have got Emmanuel Adebayor. Right. You what know is? the striker, the Togo? Yep, Togo striker. He is in the same list as the Croatian midfielder, not Luka Modric, Matteo Kovacic, mm-hmm. as well as AC Milan midfielder Robinho. Midfielder? Winger, forward. Um, we also have oh, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Watkins, Ollie Watkins, or yeah. Oliver, depends on how right. you know him. I'm going to start taking points off if you don't <laughs> stop right Saka Palmer. Okay. Taylor well, Wright. Wait, 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 hold on, but what, what are you saying about they are? Oh, uh, scored an England we, we knockout points, game. Though. Okay. Uh, Taylor, Wright, Anderson, Scottish yeah. players. Okay. And then <laughs> so Salah, Rashford, and Sancho, Sancho are Premier League wingers. Okay. You have two points. I'll take it. Okay. Two, potentially. So you got a point for Kovacic, Adebayor, Rubinho, City, Real Madrid players. Nice. Okay. Greg Taylor, Scott Wright and Elliot Anderson is also a category and Aaron's done this category before. What is it? They all have surnames of Darts World Champions. Oh, Gary Anderson. Peter Wright? Yeah, Phil Taylor. Phil Taylor. Yes. We also have as a category Saka, Sancho and Rashford. What did they all do in a Euro final? They all missed a penalty in a Euro final. That's a good category. Right, okay. And Salah, Watkins, Palmer last season. They all had four scorers. Hmm? Second, third, and fourth top scorers? No. no. They all had 10 goals and assists in the Premier League. Oh. That's tricky. Yeah, that's tough. Yes. You get two points, so. Take it. Going into the last round, which is missing vowels. In this round, oh, statements yes, will be shown to you with the vowels missing. To gain a point, you must tell me the answer within 10 seconds. <coughs> the statements can have anything at all to do with football. Aaron's been good at this, though. And this. Oh, good at this. This is the hardest it's ever been. Oh, people ask for right. it to be more difficult. Great. Anyway. Great. Here is the first one. Wout Feiss. Wout, uh, <laughs> yeah. Wout Feiss? Yeah, I think that's how you pronounce oh, it. Right, Let's see if you're right. It. Of course you are. Feiss, maybe? Yeah, I'm mm-hmm. not sure. On to number two. Oh, my. Heidenheim, what are they called? No. That is a football team, Heidenheim? No, he's not happy with it. Oh. Uh, Five seconds. What's your guess? Heidenheim. 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 Glad to see your answer. That's a point. Oh. We to don't ever, don't ever, oh, right. don't, don't ever, yourself. don't ever look at me and no, no. think, I'm giving you we nothing, can't, mate. see, there's a curtain. Exactly. <laughs> Number three. <laughs> well done if you get this at home. Five seconds. Oh. <laughs> Oliver... That's your time up. Do you want to give a quick guess? Quick, we won't quick, get quick. the point. We won't get the point here. Okay. Oliver. Is it Oliver, the first no. one? Okay, ah. never mind. There might have been a Rondo answer recently. Let's just show the people at home. It is Alvaro Odriazola. Oh, mate, I don't know who he is. On I to the mind. next one. Kevin Campbell? That's the dumbest answer you've ever seen. <laughs> oh yeah, it's got a key. <laughs> I think you can get this. Empoli? Is it? Empoli! 100%. It was past the time. Oh, t- I'll give you. <laughs> and the final one of the whole video. Come on. 
London. No, there's no, no London. Yeah. Real. It's that tricky. I can't even remember the answer. Yeah. Five seconds. They ask for harder ones. It's just... Ah! Time's up. What is this? Let's see. Adnan. No. Andoni Arayola. Oh, that's so difficult. That is, it's very difficult. The comments Getting ask for Arayola it. Arayola from just R I'm and L. Arayola, that was really No really chance tough. anyone got that. Why did, they did. Come, why, did, why did you ask these to be harder? That was, that was painful. To be fair, they were absolute gimmies before. Yes. Very well. Yeah. Right. Congratulations, you have once again completed the world's hardest quiz. To achieve a pass, you must comment your score below. Like the video, subscribe to the channel, and how many do you think you need to score? What's oh. out of? 35. Oh, you needed at least 20. I don't think we even got 20. 20 I think you needed 22 or 3. I think we got just I'll say that. you need 24, and I think we got 21. You got 24. Oh, oh that's quite good, actually. It was 25 or 26 recently, I'm sure. I don't... Uh, oh, wait. I think we might have passed it. I don't think so. Let's see if you have. Oh, oh, that point. <laughs> he took that point off us at the start. That's outrageous. Get the point back. He took two points, actually. <laughs> we got 26. But he gave us he gave us yeah, a few gimmies later on. Ridiculous. Let us know what you thought in the comments. Was it too hard? Too easy? That was good. What you scored? Leave a like, subscribe, and as always, take, take it easy. easy.